Hey guys, this is Drax, and today I wanted to show you a Darth Maul kill streak I managed to pull off during one of the assaults on feed. Now, if you've been playing the Battlefront 2 beta and haven't been able to unlock one of the heroes yet, a simple tip here is to use the Specialist class. In its current state, I would say it's a little bit overpowered with that infiltration ability that allows you to see where enemies are on the minimap and the use of the infamous E4 which never overheats. I used it in this game to unlock Darth Maul early on and get the kills rolling while outside the palace. Now when I first played the game on day one of the pre-beta I was able to unlock more but I died fairly quickly after doing so. Heroes have far less health than they had in the previous game with a new tier system where if you drop below a certain amount of health you can't regen it all back. This can leave you weaker after an engagement where you take a lot of damage and in essence you get killed faster the next time you face anyone. So on day one I unlocked more twice and died within 5 minutes on both times. And to be honest I thought the heroes, especially more, was a bit weak. But that was until I found the arcade mode where you can use Darth Maul and train yourself to use his abilities. And this basically is the point of the video, you want to use his abilities and saber swipes at the right time. In the beta you don't have access to star cards for Rey or Darth Maul, and I'm unsure as to whether certain abilities have been set at a high level for the beta, but by far the most impressive ability Darth Maul has is the chokehold. This is the one where you choke someone, lift them up in the air and then throw them against a wall. The best time to use this being when faced with multiple enemies. A few times now I've burst into a ring and seen 4 or 5 guys in front of me. By using the choke throw you disable them for a few seconds allowing you to perform a room clear. Without this ability it simply wouldn't be possible and entering the room with that number of foes would equal death, so you can see its importance. Another ability more has is the furious throw with the lightsaber, and this is probably the one that requires the most skill and the best timing. On the old Battlefront 2 he used to throw it forward with a horizontal spin, but in this one it travels with a vertical spin, making the area of effect far smaller. Still hits with the saber throw usually result in quick kills and are ideal for taking out that opponent at distance. From what I've seen so far, if you line it up nicely, the lightsaber will travel through multiple enemies and return through them, sometimes counting as multiple hits. Its final ability is the spin attack. This allows you to bridge gaps easily and jump enemies before they have time to react. I find the best combo when entering rooms to be start with a choke hold to disable, then take out anyone off to the side, possibly a single target with a furious throw, and finish the rest off with a spin attack and a few hits of the lightsaber. You then use your second spin attack to get out there if needed. It's good to keep one spin in reserve for use on emergencies, otherwise you can use your jump to get out of there. The key thing to do with all these new heroes is to get in, do your damage and get out. If it goes really well then you clear the room, if not you get out and regen your health to try again. So hopefully this helps you guys out a bit with using Darth Maul and the other heroes. I have loads of hero footage from the beta so if you want to see more let me know. This won't be the biggest kill streak you see as we win the game pretty quick, but at least it gives you an idea of how to use Darth Maul. Hope you enjoyed the gameplay and I'll see you next time. Reminds me so much of the E3 or 4. 
when you get that free round back, it's ridiculous. You, yeah, you're dark now, I think. He said he was rubbing. Might win this. But then again, we might not, Drax. This is where you earn your money, mate. Secure the throne room before reinforcements arrive. Nabu will fall to the Separatist army. Get in there, boys. You have like what? You got like double the score, or no? Triple. You got triple the score that top player on them. Superior weapons and programming have triumphed. The palace has fallen, as has the moon. What do you do? Run at people, especially headshot them. <laughs> 